And here he is, man. The retro carded 90s animated series Spider-Man action figure. Check him out. Check all the stuff that he comes with. Check him in this retro card, man. It looks super duper fresh, purple. You know, actually, my favorite one in the box in this carded, um, in this, in this, in this kind of, I, I'm losing my words, but in this card is the 2099 Spider Man. It, it just goes well with its colors. But anyway, yeah, man, check it out. It has a little description here. It says, Bitten by a radioactive spider. The mild mannered Peter Parker becomes the wall crawling, web slinging, amazing Spider Man. Oh, yeah, man. And of course, it tells you, uh, danger. Uh, I guess uh, it's not meant for three-year-olds. But uh, yeah, tell that to the kids. So yeah, man, we're going to pull this one out the box pretty soon. And we'll get down to it. And yeah. And here we are, man. Here he is. I got him posing on one of these, uh, I think, Storm Collectible stands. Looking pretty fresh. Looking, looking ill. Before we uh, uh, I pull him off the stand, I just want to let you know it comes with these accessories. That web that he's actually holding is actually mine. But uh, yeah, it comes with this accessory right here, this web, which is pretty cool. You can do, you can tie it up somehow, and uh, you know, if you want to, get some um, some nice white little wires, and you can put it on someone's face, you know, make them do something like that. Uh, it comes with two of these, a smaller one, and then a big one, which is tight. It comes with four interchangeable hands. Uh, wait a minute, no, it doesn't. It comes with uh. Three pairs of interchangeable hands. Where is my other man's fist? Oh, he's actually, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it has, you know, two pair of fists. You know, he actually is holding one right there on camera. Um, then he has two, uh, open, a pair of open hands, you know. And then two thwipping hands, which is pretty tight, you know. So, but yeah, man, here he is. Let's go ahead and uh, uh, pull him out of here, man. Let's take a look at a closer look. Like, like, this dude is tight. This dude is tight. I made this webbing, by the way. I eventually, I'll, I'll make some uh, tutorials on how y'all can do your own. But, uh, you know, a lot of the webbing and cuz with the action figures that, for the Spider-Man toys, they suck. You know, so uh, I learned how to make my custom own by just going on YouTube and watching some other cats do it. And then, you know, doing it. And then, uh, yeah, let's pull this out real quick. Pull this to the side. And enjoy this dude. Look at him, man. And of course, let's just pose them up real quick. Let's give him the, a pair of, of closed fists real quick. And you know, you just pull it out, put it back in. You know, you feel it snap. And then, yeah, man, this dude is just tight. Look how fresh this fool is. You know, like, like, ah, man, this Spider-Man is just super clean. As you can see, the shadow. The shadowing right here. Uh, uh, can you see that? You see, you know, which is not that bad on this figure. A lot, a lot, like uh, um, I haven't pulled out the X Men ones, uh, the animated series. Series they have a lot of shadowing, but this one is not that bad. I feel like this white one might be the um, the best shadow shadowed version action figure. You know, because Nika does a lot of. Uh, or NECA, whatever you call it, but NECA, I'm going to call it NECA, ha has a lot of animated series, uh, TMNT, and, and like the way they shadow their figures is just so dope. But yeah, man, the cell shadowing is ill. The cool thing about this one, man, that uh, I think this is the first uh, pegless Spider-Man action figures, because usually, usually you would see the pegs on here. Uh, let, me, let me bring those out for example. Uh, so you don't see the pegs. You know, you don't see the pegs right here that you, they usually have. It's it's pretty cool, you know. Um, all right. And there's no hole here in the back. Is that a crack? Oh, oh no, no. That's, that's, look, it's a little, a little crevice that they tried to make right here. Um, can you guys see that? Like the little right here. But anyway, so let's go through some articulation. He, look, he can look all the way up, which is tight. He's on a ball joint, left, right, up, uh, butterfly, butterfly joints right here, you know. 
Get him all the way up like this. Like, you'll be able to put this dude in hella cool poses. Ah, Mary Jane, where are you? You know, when he lost Mary Jane in the cartoon. And then uh, Ab Crunch. Uh, I can't go that far back up. But it does, uh, right here, you can actually, uh, I don't know what they call it, but from the torso, you can make them go all the way up like this, which is dope, all the way down, and then a little bit more ab crunch. Um, of course, double jointed elbows right there. Is it double jointed? Oh. I think it is. I don't want to mess with it. Uh, and then the legs, double jointed legs, which is tight. Uh, right here, there's a little paint defects right here, but I'm, it's not not that big of a deal. You see, there's a little piece right here coming out. Um, yeah. And then the the legs, you know, right here. See how far they go up, far they go down. Um, there's no articulation on the feet. I know that on the uh, Renew Your Vow Spider-Man, uh, there is some articulation. I, I see some cats remove the legs and actually put it on this one. I might do that. Uh, the cool thing about this one, though, is the face, the eyes. You know, it really captures that animated series look uh, from the TV show, you know, which I think we, we've been missing, man. And uh, I hope they do, if they ever make a Peter Parker version i hope that it looks like the because i know they made one before but I, I really would like it to look like you know the actual cartoon but uh yeah it's pretty dope man you can do you can put this dude in some pretty ill poses you know um you know so you know like boom Gotta get the articulation going, man. Ah! Move over here. Looking fresh, man. Looking super duper fresh. But yeah, man, it, it's uh it's a pretty clean, clean, clean figure. Let's see how he holds up with the rhino. Like, you know, it's uh it's dope. Fix the rhino's feet real quick. But yeah, there's a lot of cool Spider-Man figures that came out in the year 2022, man. And um, of course, Brian O was one of them, but actual Spider-Man, Spider-Man figures. You know, this one and the, was it the Amazing Spider-Man, for uh, Amazing Fantasy Spider-Man have to be one of mine. Let's do some comparisons, man. Here's the Amazing Spider-Man, the Amazing Fantasy Spider-Man, which is tight, you know. And then here's the Renew Your Vow Spider-Man. Uh, uh, dope picture shot. Um, out of all of them, you know, a lot of people really like this one. Um, but I don't like the eyes on it, dude. It's just they look ugly to me. <laughs> but yeah, here's the articulated feet that people have been swapping the legs for, you know. Um, but yeah, like, like this one just looks super dope, you know. But this one's tight too, you know. But it's not about him today. We're going to put, put these ones in the back. But, yeah, man, uh, if you end up getting this figure, you won't be you won't be mad that you got it. And just like these figures, these actually got to be, this is also pinless, you know, meaning that you don't see the pins, man. Uh, but, yeah, you know, of course, uh, I think there's double jointed elbows, man. I don't want to break it. Yeah, I think it is, but I'll I'll I'll, I'll fix I'll mess with that later. Um, but yeah, man, you can put this dude in a bunch of bunch of different kind of poses, you know. You can move him that way, so he's looking up. But yeah, man, he just looks really really fresh. You know, a lot of the Marvel Legend figures. What I like what they do with the Spider Man figures is that the lines are all, you know, put in. You know, when the Mayfix figures are dope, but I feel like that's what they're missing sometimes. It's like the the black outlines of the of his costume are never really there. But like, yeah, man, like I can see myself playing with this one for a very very long time. You know, 
And, you know, he I haven't pulled out my retro, the original retro Spider-Man that came out a few years ago yet. You know, this one isn't that big, like, like as that one, but that one has so much presence. But this one isn't that tiny either, you know. So, like, when he turns into the, like, on... Um, the black animated uh, Spidey symbiote suit, the retro carded one, like he's, it's a little bit more stocky. Um, so you feel like when he get, it's not the same uh, body, uh, body mold. You know, it, it's obvious a little bit smaller than when he turns into the black Spider Man suit. You know, uh, but yeah, man, this dude is fresh. Yeah. So, how's that look like on camera? Okay, cool. It looks tight. It looks tight. Okay. So, actually, if we do some head swaps. Um, let me pull this the fuck out. Um, boom. And we, sw we swap the heads real quick. Uh-oh. All right. Oh, that don't look that bad. That shit looks fresh. You know? Uh, the colors, uh, I feel like there's a matte finish on on this uh, on this cat scope. But, yeah, that don't look that bad. That one looks dope. You know? Let's see how this one looks on that one. Hold on. That one looks dope too. Yeah. Um, but yeah, this retro carded Spider Man is I think got to be one of my favorites. Uh, yeah, that's a different color red, but yeah, let's put it back. Uh oh, got heads flying everywhere. I would definitely. If you're a big Spider-Man fan, this one has to be up there in one of the, the top Marvel Legends, man. You know, I know they got a Mafex version with the same color scheme. Um, that's supposed to be dope. We'll do a review on that one eventually. But yeah, like ankle swivel, swivel right here at the leg, you know. So, yeah, man, he's fresh. He's really, really fresh. You can put him in super, some ill poses. Get his, let's switch out the hands real quick. In a crouching stance. Boom, boom. Where's the other open hand? But, yeah, man, uh, I'd recommend, if you, get, you know, this would be a dope, dope addition. Put his head up like that. You know, this one. Usually, they don't get like to get it like this. Uh, that's one. But yeah, here he is, the retro card of Spider Man, man. Added to your collection. I'm definitely did for myself. Um, I really like it a lot. You know, I, I had a lot of fun posing this one with Rhino. Uh, I'll show you and you'll eventually see, you know. So like, yeah. So looking mad fresh, man. Super duper. But yeah, like I said, pinless. But yeah. Oh, uh, I don't know if this is dope stance right there. 
looking fresh. All right, y'all. Peace. Um, yeah, add 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 your thoughts or comments below. What's your favorite Spider-Man figure? Does this one hold up for 2022? Um, does it beat the Amazing Fantasy Spider-Man? Does it beat the Renew Valves? For me, this one and the Amazing the Amazing Fantasy Spider-Man are are my favorites of the year. Where the hell is this dude's at? Yeah, so, but yeah. This would definitely go with the other, your other animated versions, uh, your animated series uh, villains and stuff like that. So, yeah. All right, y'all. Peace.